Hey guys, thanks for joining me again today and today I'm going to be talking about a bit of a, a background on why I tend to draw and paint uh, faces of women which are just half a face and not the full face so just one side of the face, the eyes, half a nose, half a lip, the ear and half the side of the head. So um, I, I'm talking about something like this so either it is just a, a side face or I tend to draw a lot of uh, faces that are not fully there. Now, the reason behind that is, um, I'm not going to tell you a very long story so you don't get bored, but it is interesting to know why artists sometimes tend to, um, you know, lean towards um, that kind of art or what what is the history behind their art or why is it that they're drawn to uh, you know always sketch those kind of images so also I'm wearing a t-shirt that I painted which is again half a face and the other side is doodles I'll show you I'll just try and balance so you can see it's lady half a face and doodles on the other side so yeah so, when I was a teenager, I suffered from really bad, 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 I mean bad, acne. It's very depressing, it's uh, embarrassing, it's isolating, you know, everything, you know, when you're in the spotlight, <laughs> no pun intended, um, it's, it's very depressing to be in that place and I just found I used to cover my face with my hair and my forehead you know so I didn't have to show my face and I never looked people in the eye because I was always embarrassed about what they would see on me and I suffered for a, a long time a good part of my teenage my youth um, I think until my late 20s I suffered from acne and and then I started drawing these kind of sketches where there's beautiful women, you know, flowing hair and beautiful skin. And and I guess that's where that art comes from, is that part of my life where I suffered from acne. And I'm sure loads of women, girls can relate to that, you know, where they don't want to, where they're very, you know, conscious of how they look or what other people might see. But you know what? It's okay. It's part of life. And it's hard and I can't say you know oh, you'll get over it or it's it's okay cover it up because um, I've been there and I know what it feels like so it's you know that's that's where my art comes from the other reason uh, why I draw really glimmering eyes or I tend to draw a lot of eyes in my sketches or my artwork if you've seen uh, on my Instagram page um, is because I suffer from an eye condition called keratoconus. don't know if you've heard of that but um, it's the thinning of the cornea and the stage I am in at right now is um, it's 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 quite severe and um, in the coming years I would need a um, corneal transplant a graft and it's quite scary because without my lenses uh, I'm legally blind so that means that uh, eventually I'll not be able to drive I will probably have to quit my day job and there's lots of other things that you know are related to this condition so I have to wear my lenses all day take them off last thing at night put them on first thing in the morning I can't wear glasses because my number is so high so my lenses would be you can imagine very thick and they don't do that because I don't know it's just something that the opticians can't give me glasses so I'm stuck with wearing lenses and I wear two sets of lenses in both eyes a soft lens and a hard gas permeable lens which is hard to wear every day but I'm used to it and most people who see me, they don't, they can't tell that I've got an eye condition because I carry it so well. I think I've embraced the whole thing about this eye condition. And being an artist, it's really hard because sometimes when you have to really 
you know, look out for the, the minor details on a painting or, a, you know, a sketch you're doing or a live drawing. It's really difficult for me because I can't see that far. And sometimes people think I'm arrogant or uh, stuck up because I don't say hi. It's because I can't see you that far. So, yeah, now you know if you see me somewhere and I just look away, it's because I haven't seen you. Uh, I can't see your face clearly and I guess that's just part of life, eh? So I get offended when people say, are you blind? Actually, yes, I am. <laughs> but you know what? It's fine. It's all fun and games. It's it's good. It's part of life. You know, everyone's got problems. And in the end, all I got to say is, you know, don't judge um, anyone. You know, it's just be kind because you don't know what their battle is you don't know what kind of issues they have or what problems they have or illnesses they have so just be kind you know you know you'll find out that they're not that bad you know they're they're, they're also in their own journey and dealing with all, all kinds of stuff in their life so guys that's it for today that's all my art talk and what my half faces are about so if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up i'd really appreciate that and of course subscribe for more videos like these thanks guys until next time bye